Hey guys, it's me Axel again, and today we will be learning how to install Galactic Craft for the Mac on Minecraft version 1.5.2. Uh, <laughs> My bad guys, sorry. Alright, this is the mod we're installing, and all these links will be in the description below. Um, you will actually need a variety of mods to be able to install this, so let's get going. First of all, let's actually download Galactic Craft. Um, we're just going to download the latest build. So, the, and, and don't get me wrong, guys, this link will be in the description for yourself. So, let's get this. Let's put this to the desktop. Alrighty. The next, uh, the next thing you'll need um, to be able to do any of the crafting whatsoever inside of Galactic Craft, you'll need thermal expansion and which that requires the COFH core and then also the uh, thermal expansion jar which is this link right here uh wait wrong one this link so you want to download this let it go through its ad fly thing yeah sometimes i actually don't wish they had these ad fly things it's really annoying I mean, I've clicked it so many times it's not even funny. All right, um, the next thing you'll also need alongside this is, well, the thermal expansion jar. And I will do note that the 2.4.2 is broken. So you'll want to use the 2.4.1. And there will be links for this in the description as well. And another ad fly. Yeah, I really don't like ad flies whatsoever. Alright, I'll show these in Finder, um, and we'll move the COF H mod there to the desktop, and then the thermal expansion. And lastly, but uh, not least, you will need Forge. And I suggest downloading the latest version in general. Uh, I'll link you to the website. Uh, well, actually, I'll link you to the files location. Just download the universal. Don't download the source, Javadox, or changelog. Those you don't need them. Click on that and add fly again. Really? Really? Gosh, these people just want money from me. And now we have a sorry, but that link has been deleted. Go back to add fly. Oh. Wow. <laughs> That's not even right. They have two AdFly links on one thing just to download it. Wow. They are just trying to just get money off of us. God. All right. Uh, let's close that. And we'll just go ahead and push this down. All right. Next thing you're going to need to do is because, well, I don't know if your jar is broken or not. So you're going to want to open your Minecraft up and you're going to want to force update it. It's pretty simple to do. Just the hell is all that oh well um, go to options just click force update and click done and I have to re-log in because I force updated it once and there we go and let it download and whatnot so next thing you're gonna want to do is you want to go to the finder and well you want to click go to where is it you want to go to folder. Actually, it's up here. And go to folder. And you want to go to. That's actually the wrong thing. Actually, I will link it in the description below of where you need to go to. Uh, so you'll eventually get to this folder and your application support. And you will want to find Minecraft. And, well, it's not finished downloading. Come on, Minecraft download already you know what i'll cut the video right here j j just so just so you can uh don't have to um experience the wait well guys this was awkward it took like a minute or two to download minecraft who knows well anyhow once you have minecraft started up go ahead and quit it back out um go back into the bin folder and go to the minecraft jar and I will also link this in the description as well. You will need the unarchiver to unarchive your jar file. 
I use the Honor Archiver. Some other people use other things, but I use the Honor Archiver because I believe it's the best. I like it a lot, and it just is pretty good. Okay, arrange these by kind. If you if you don't want to, you don't have to, but I, I prefer I prefer because it lists all the folders at top. You want to uh, unarchive your Minecraft Forge Universal. And in this folder, you're going to get a lot of files. And you're going to want to uh, alt shift a no, command, er, er. sorry, um, command A. And you're going to want to take all these files and you're going to want to drag them in here and apply to all and replace. Everything should be replaced in there and whatnot. So let's go ahead and scroll all the way up here. And you will want to always remember to do this step because I will get so many comments in the comment section below that they get a blank screen or that it does it's black. Delete your meta and if you don't, it'll be black. All right, and once that's deleted, go ahead, go back out, uh, and we'll. So, oh, well, here we'll do it this way. Uh, you can rename your folder to have just a dot jar on it, but just uh, highlight all these and compress them all. Lots of people don't like it being so messy. So there we go. Got an archive.zip, and you want to no. Not do that. Do not do that. You want to rename it to Minecraft.jar. And yes, use .jar. Next, you can go ahead and delete this folder. No one really cares about it anymore. You can rename this to backup if you want. And you can move this in here now. And let's go back. You're going to want to be in this folder again. Go ahead and start Minecraft up. Uh, Forge needs to generate its all of its necessary files, so let's give it a moment to log in. Huh. Oh, there we go. And I'll say that it's downloading all the necessary files and whatnot, and it'll eventually be done. Very Give me a moment guys. About that guys. I figured out what I did wrong. Um I downloaded the wrong version of Forge. <laughs> yeah, uh some of their things are built uh broken, so you're gonna want to download this one. I will actually link this this link directly uh inside the description, so I am sorry about that. Let's give it a moment to re-download uh, itself. We'll delete that. We'll delete this too. Skip this ad, because no one likes ads. No one, not even cows. Of all their hate for the world, they do not like ads whatsoever. I'm sorry for the uh, over prolonged uh, tutorial video but that's what it is make sure you have your backup just delete this jar and open with the unarchiver again and open this up and take all these whoopsie keep doing this wrong don't know why lots of delays move them all here and apply to all replace and let's go ahead and arrange these by name. I mean kind, my bad. And scroll up to the top. Delete meta inf again. Compress them all again. Already been through this like three times, sorry. <laughs> Alright. Compress them all. And move this to the desktop. Go back. Rename this to minecraft.jar. Move this to trash. It, it doesn't make me open the folder instead. Place this in here. And go ahead and start up your Minecraft. Everything should be fine. Yep, 
look at that. Purring like a kitten. Alright, you don't need this open anymore. Alright, so it should be, uh, everything should be stalled for Forge. So just go ahead and quit your game. Uh, go back to the uh, main folder. Alright, now, this is where a lot of people probably get confused. You want to go into the core mods folder. You want to go to move Galactic Craft over into here. And you're going to want to move over the COFH core. And lastly but not least, you're going to want to move to the mods folder, not the core mods folder. Thermal expansion. Once that's moved over, you can go ahead and start your Minecraft back up. And everything should be tip top shape. And just to show that it works, let's go and create a new world. Make it a survival. No, no, no. I'll have to open it to land. Wow, that's pretty, pretty big. So, er. there's normal. And let's open the land. We'll allow cheats. We'll put the main game mode in survival. I mean, creative. So I go like this. And let's get a rocket ship. <sighs> Gotta uh, use E to open it up. Don't usually use E. We'll take a launch pad. And a spaceship. Where's the uh, free field? There's free field. And we'll take a purple pot. And let's go ahead and have liftoff. If that's fine with you all. If I'm not spoiling what the moon looks like. If you haven't received it yet. Like this. This looks just beautiful. Just beautiful. We'll go ahead and lift off. Alright guys, this is Axel, and I'm glad that you could be watching this video. So, let's have liftoff in 2, 1. Alright guys, you have a wonderful time. And this is Axel, and this is another tutorial video for Galactic Craft. You have a wonderful time. Bye now. Well, guys, this is Axel, and well, I approve all these videos. And well, if you like any of them, feel free to subscribe in the right hand corner, or hell, even uh, toss a comment in the comment section saying how much you like the videos. This is Axel, and I approve this message. Have a wonderful day, guys.